Hello ladies and gentlemen, Magnadox here for another episode of Dark Souls. And now we're going to see just what terrifying creature awaits. Oh, it's a boss battle. What is that? What is going on? Is this going to be one of the boss souls? One of the souls I need? Is this the actual Seath the Scaleless fight? Oh, it's it's the actual Seath the Scaleless fight. Oh, no. Okay, we got to get feel, feel for his moves. Let's stick back. Okay, that's more directional now. It's not like he can just kill me instantly. Oh, those tentacles! Okay, he has a lot of long range. Order is close range. That did nothing. Oh, his close range and long range are about the same. The same things. I hit him! Healing. What's healing him? Oh. 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 Was that the only one? Was it just one crystal that was healing him up? I missed. Yeah, now it can actually be damaged. That's not doing crazy amounts of damage, and that's scaring me. It's not even doing too much purge damage. His tentacles, okay. So his tentacles are supposed to keep you in. What if I get behind? Him? Oh, he just smacks me around. Oh, he just smacks me around real good. Oh, that's lovely. I think if you stay like right here, that attack won't be. No, no. So if I just stay up here and wail on This is nothing I don't understand. Oh crap, he's about to do something crazy. What? What? Oh, you have to be super far back for that not to kill you. Okay, so when he starts doing that, I gotta I gotta roll back. I gotta. <laughs> I can do this. I can do this. I really there has to be a bonfire somewhere down there I haven't found yet. Because making this huge journey. When cursed, oh, I didn't re I didn't finish that. What did that say? Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, I, I just read what it does. Oh, because that message, I, I... I didn't get to read it. I wanted to make sure that it was... Um, I want to see what happened, because I noticed my health was reduced. But I wanted to see what else happened. So, I'm not able to cure humanity... I'm not able to, or I'm not able to become human again, I'm not able to kindle bonfires, and I'm not able to, I can't have full health while I'm cursed. But I can attack ghosts without a uh, transient, without using the transient curse item. So that's pretty cool. But, seeing as how Seath's whole method of killing you involves cursing you and not necessarily doing damage to you I feel like having reduced health is not a big deal when fighting Seath like it's not going to be a problem as long as I can the only problem that's going to cause is trying to get past the clams but I might be able to do 
Might be able to rush past them like I'm rushing past these crystal giants. So. The sea fight. All he does is curse you. And I have a purging stone. but And, I, and that does cure the curse. But I don't want to do that until I've killed sea. Because I honestly don't think that being cursed is going to have too big of an effect on the sea fight. Because... He doesn't do damage. He doesn't do that much damage anyway. The only damage he does is when you get behind him and he slaps you around with his tentacles. I just won't do that. <laughs> oh, do I have to destroy the... Why did I come down here? I'm not supposed to come down all the way. But I'm not going to try to uh, get behind him anymore because I know better than that. But if he does come out with an attack that actually does good damage, I might have to cure the curse. I just might have to go out of my way for that. No, still not rating. People just don't don't rate a good uh, message these days. Hopefully, I can get past these clams and heal myself when I'm on the other side because they attack very slowly. Yeah. Simple. Simple and easy. Oh, he's pretty bright. He goes straight. Oh, man. Of course, this person went straight to the center. I forgot that. That was my fault. And I am attempting to fix it. I'm just trying to become a better Dark Souls player. There we go. Okay, go straight down the middle first. I'll have to kill the crystals again. Don't get behind them. Good. Stay broken. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stay. Side. Give you a short range. Watch out for that. You can do long range, I believe. Or short range doesn't matter at this point. I can't see a thing. Where? What are these camera angles? Just stop blocking onto him. I couldn't see. I couldn't see! What was I supposed to do? I was blind! Oh, oh get away. I'm gonna kill this crystal. Without getting behind him, because I get behind him, he's gonna trash me. Turn, 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 turn. Thank you, thank you. Okay, you're gonna do straight down the middle, short range, long range. What, what's going on? Side. Wait. 
attacks, do a sweeping attack. Sweeping attack. Oh no, it's in center, it's still hitting. Push, 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 very close. me my distance so it's me Point of healing up, but I might want to. Is he charging up again? I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay, so I can't. If I keep fighting him from one side, he's going to get closer and closer until I'm backed up against a wall, and even if he. Or not even if he, but when he uses his, that, I guess, ultimate, was what I'd call it, that ultimate attack that sort of completely surrounds him, I won't have enough room to run away. So I have to keep, whenever I'm fighting him, I have to keep moving him back and forth on the map, or else I will not be able to kill him. You know what? I'm going to try that. I'm going to try to switch weapons this time. Because this is, I believe this is magic damage. Magic. Lightning spear. Uh, and I'm going to have to get used to this move, to its move set. And hopefully this does a bit more damage, which would make my life a little bit easier. So stabby, stabby. That's RT. Super stabby. Stab, stab. I can also stab behind a shield, but I don't think that really helps me against this see because I don't think shielding his attacks really helps because it's the curse that gets you okay, here we go into the brink get around him I guess I can test even though he has the crystal equipped I can still test on the screen doesn't seem 78. It's a 78. Close. Oh, no. What? He's already doing that? He already used that crazy attack? Okay, so the lightning spirit did 78. I'm gonna go back with my catch pole and I'm gonna see how much damage that does again. And then from there, I'll make a decision over which one's better. But he already used that immediately? He's supposed to give him this chance to turn around. Maybe I need to not try to do so much damage. One like two, one or two quick hits close, then back up so he uses a long range attack. Open? What is going on? I can't see. I can't see! How am I supposed to fight? him if I'm blindfolded. How can you kill him if the entire time your camera is looking in detail at each individual crystal he lays out? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? This sucks. This is the worst. This is the absolute worst. Well, 
as I said, I only have enough time for one. I only had enough time for one more try, and that try has been used. And he's still not dead. How am I supposed to fight him? If I lock onto him, I'm blind. If I don't lock onto him, I have to be. I have to use a good part. I have to use the part of my brain to play in this game. I have to sacrifice some of that just to pay attention to where I'm looking rather than just have it always locked on him, which makes my life a lot easier unless it blindfolds me. So now I'm stuck having to, con having to control where I look and where I move. And if I mess up even a little bit, it just kills me instantly. Oh, well... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys in a Battle of the Century, Man vs. Dragon, next time.